Meghan Markle is likely to relaunch her Instagram account, almost three years after she deactivated her personal page in 2020. A live handle, at Meghan, is believed to belong to the Duchess of Sussex, with a pink flower display picture giving nothing away. But it's the page's large 124k following which has garnered attention, and leading many to believe the platform is sitting and waiting for Meghan to use it. Followers include activist Mondana Diani, who served as president of Artual, the Sussex's media and philanthropic company, until last December. This adds to the belief the account does in fact belong to the Duchess. Meghan Markle warned against capitalizing on royal fame in Instagram return Meghan Markle first announced that she was coming back to the social media platform in an interview with The Cut last year, two years after her and the Duke of Sussex's official account at Sussex Royal was deactivated. At the time, she told the magazine, Do you want to know a secret? I'm getting back on Instagram. Is there a relaunch date? A source close to the Sussexes team was quoted by the Mail on Sunday as saying, Yes, that's her. Expect an announcement very soon. She's coming back. At the moment, very soon is the closest anyone has to a launch date. It is not officially known when the Duchess of Sussex will be reunited with the platform. Don't miss! Prince Harry and Meghan snub UK return due to feud with Princess Kate, Insight, King Charles has no time in the diary to see Harry when he returns to UK, reveal, Charles and Camilla look delighted as they watch late Queen's favourite event, Spotlight, according to experts, when she does, she could make around $1 million per post. Social media expert and advisor Eric Schiffer told Mail Online that Meghan's return to Instagram will not surprise anyone, adding that the Duchess now has a new talent manager and social media is the next logical step. He added, I would expect her to quickly become one of the most followed accounts on Instagram. You have celebrities like the Kardashians who can command $1 million, £790,000, and up for a single post promoting a product. There is no reason Meghan couldn't be earning those sorts of fees. She has to be careful, as a duchess, to avoid being seen to be hawking every product under the sun. She will align with quality brands and companies that are on point with her political and social beliefs. According to a report in the New York Post earlier this month Meghan first set up the handle at Meghan when she launched her Spotify podcast. A source told Page Six, Meghan was set to go live on Insta but changed her mind shortly before she launched her Archetypes podcast so it's just sitting there now. Meghan's footprint on the web prior to her 2018 marriage to Prince Harry, suits actress Meghan's personal Instagram following stood at more than 3 million, while tens of thousands of fans signed up for her now-defunct lifestyle blog The Tig. When she first launched the lifestyle blog, she said the name was inspired by the white team Yanello. She explained, Dinianello is a full-body dread wine that I tried about seven years ago. In wine circles, it is nicknamed Tig. It was my first moment of getting it, I finally understood what people meant by the body, structure, finish, legs of wine. The Tig is my nickname for me getting it. Not just wine, but everything, 